I have, I've wanted to come to this museum for a long time. But being the workaholic I am, like hopping on a plane and coming to Lincoln, Nebraska, you know, just to see a museum, it just, it sounds frivolous, you know, it's just, I, gotta, I gotta get some stuff done, you know. But being invited to come here as a guest speaker, that was like the catalyst I needed to make it happen. I mean, finally I can get there, but I can also be doing something and, you know, inspiring people and telling my story at the same time. So I was so happy, I was so happy to finally be back here. I gotta say, I was, I was, uh, I was shocked, to be honest. Like, I thought the Cars and Coffee would probably be about maybe 50 cars, you know, and then maybe if we're lucky, we get like 30 people or, you know, they, they come in and listen to me tell my silly stories. But I, I couldn't believe it when I went out there and the cars are just pouring in and then the parking lot's full, then everyone's parking on the grass. It was wild. It was really cool. So I guess there was over 500 cars yesterday, which like set a new record, which was amazing. And then of course talking to them, I mean, talking to them, that was a big room of people. I don't know how many people were there. But it was really great. It was really, it was really re rewarding and satisfying to see that because this is like, you know, Lincoln, Nebraska. This is grassroots America. You know, this is the, the middle of it all. And to see that many car guys in a little town in Nebraska is really cool. It's been great to be here. I'm really thankful. The you know, Museum of American Speed invited me here, and now I don't want to leave. <laughs>